like I've seen the vintage like from like thrifting like you before you go to a thrift store and you know you find a cool vintage piece you get excited you know right you, you get all happy now it's like you go to 10 thrift stores and you don't find anything or well, if you do find so something much, it's the overpriced thing is, there's there's a lot of people thrifting now yeah that's the problem and the yeah. thing is before you hit the store someone else has hit it and also or not even that you have to be careful it even made it to the floor yeah because now uh my thrift stores are doing ebays so like all and, salvation armies have an ebay all goodwills have is, an ebay some of these people depending on which store it is they're starting to catch on to which items people are buying yep, and, and why they're it. buying yep. them because i was in this one thrift store and i just bought like a i just got it by the a way a yukon a yukon jacket it's just like a little sports jacket i think it was like a team nike and i bought it and it was like seven bucks yeah and i bought it anyways i'm like ah, i'll sell it for 30 35 bucks no problem you know whatever i just want inventory yeah so i'm gonna buy it it's a little overpriced but whatever when i put it up on the counter she's like oh you've seen how much this goes for she's that's exactly what she said to me and i'm like hold on a second like how are you why i got a carhartt jacket the other day and a salvation army manager um walked up as i was checking out and he's like damn how did you get this how did it make it to the floor yeah because they probably wanted to they sell take it for not, ebay so yeah, they exactly. had they, they had similar jackets to this but they were miami heat and they were probably hundreds of them and he literally like couldn't get enough he walked with his handful and just like started to rush it upstairs right. i was like what are you doing he's like oh no this is supposed to be on the floor so it's what? like <laughs> people are getting stingy like well, they're starting to try to make more money off it because they see they see they're trying to be resellers but like are Whoa. they going to take returns are they going to take the damages are they well, going to clean gonna, it up have to mess with all that yeah you know so that's that's where it comes that. down to you know we take the risk of like you said if, if it has a stain we have to see if it takes a stain out you know well I'll, For, I, buy stuff, them. I buy stuff all the time that's stained that I, yeah. I think it's cool because it's just like you don't want to pass the item and you're actually taking yeah. the risk seeing and sometimes you throw it in the wash and it comes out you know yeah. it, it's a sometimes all it took was just one wash, wash. It doesn't. yeah that's true <laughs> I've had some short, uh, shirts recently that haven't came. What I used, but they're so cool. Forty shirts. for both, for the set, twenty-five and fifteen. What I would used to do is I used to uh, tie dye. Five. It's actually not a bad deal for both sets of weights. Yeah, no, for twenty-five and fifteen. No, you know. that's a good. Usually they charge a dollar a pound, yeah, so it'd be like price. sixty bucks. Honestly, someone would charge forty, for fifty bucks just for one set of those. Yeah. But like you said, you know, I'm just trying to. Yeah, that's 30, get, get rid of 30 stuff. pounds extra that I could get rid of. But uh, I'm going to start walking around because I'm freezing. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Hey, yeah, good bro. Looks, appreciate bro. you. I might I'll be back, back next Sunday. So uh, right, I might have cool. some new stuff. So All I right, come cool. every I'm, Sunday. I might be setting up next Sunday. 20. Maybe I'll see you. All right, bro. Good luck, my man. Yeah, man. Looking full. Okay. Let me see. Let me see. You sell a lot online? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have a store too or just online? Only online. Yeah. Yeah, you don't see too many people with like just specific, you know, because yeah. obviously you're just toys and stuff. Uh -huh, yeah. You do well though? Yeah, I do. Every weekend? Yeah. Yeah. But mostly I sell, I come from Orlando, but I came to visit my family here. Oh, okay. I bring some stuff. Is there markets like this in Orlando? Yeah. Yeah. A lot Good. <laughs> a lot better. Yeah. There's one that open only on Mondays, right? Wow, but, Mondays. But that thing is packed. Yeah. And when it's holiday, forget it. It's like this big. For buyers or sellers or both? Both. 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 And like you have a lot of vintage stuff. People looking for vintage. Yeah. Vintage. Yeah. Now down here, there's usually the the group. There's probably like 20 kids. But I think there's a vintage event in Miami, so they're not here today. That's why I was talking to the other guy about it. But you never go to the swap shop, or the one that's 
Legwork? No, I haven't. And then I, I'm it's coming from South Beach, so I know there's a Hialeah too, I think. Or Miami, but yeah. I don't know. That might be no, so I so. I went to the one, the, the soft shop in the. Lake Worth, and it was good? It's a smaller, but it's more costly than people. Yeah. yeah, and I'm sure that area has I, more money. Yeah. A little cheaper, it's like almost the same price to get in, like here. Yeah. yeah. Well, it used to be $5 cheaper. It used to be only $20, $20 yeah, you know, now it's $25. For both sets, so twenty five and fifteen. Thank you. Enjoy. So now we're gonna take this and I'm gonna go buy some knives. I'll give her 10 bucks for it. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Ugh. I needed this, or I needed some new blades. It was ten dollars for all this. This is like forty dollars. So, you can use this to unhem jeans and whatnot. But yeah, nice little ten dollar purchase. I wanted five bucks for the box. Thank you. Thank you. Great day, huh? Yeah. Uh, you could put uh, children or a dog or anything, any really. You could use it as like a tow truck. Like a towing, yeah. How much do you need? Eighty dollars. Uh, I don't think I know. I have a fifty or a hundred dollar bill. No. No problem. I have to use my... No, I only have 60. Perfect. Thank you. I'm sorry? This is mine. Yes. <laughs> if you want, I can leave it here while you walk around. You can come back when you're about to leave if you don't want to walk around with it. It's um, is this a club or something? No, it's it's it's, a, it's its own brand. Uh, okay. It's a lore, It's more of like a low key brand, but I looked it up on their website. and It was like 155 brand new. Yeah. yeah. I've never seen one before. Yeah, if you type in the brand on um, Google, it'll pop up uh, his website I, and stuff uh, like that. My, my closet uh, bar is starting to break out of the wall because I have so much so many coats hanging. Oh yeah. On. I think I counted 35 the other day. Wow, especially down here. Fuck man, I re yeah, I really like it though. I, I just well, that on. one's lightweight, so that one's not too... I, I just keep on buying fucking coats and I keep on putting them in there. Yeah, um, it's an addiction. It really is, I'm starting to become a hoarder. Yeah, <laughs> I think we all have uh, some fuck that. Fuck man, I really like it. Uh, you 
so you've done the research on it though so yeah actually i get these things so cheap like they make me buy them for like five bucks or something like that. I yeah can't help it but i mean i can 20. do 15 i'll take off uh, five bucks if you know make it sweeten the deal let me give a quick little search yeah, yeah of maybe course I, maybe i can find somebody selling one yeah definitely Or anything good 15 bucks beautiful thank you sir it's pretty rad man yeah enjoy it it's a lot different than anything i have i don't have anything like this that's that's what i always try to do i think about like if i have something similar you know and if i don't then hey it belongs well, in the collection my coats are, are women's coats that i can't use that i can't wear you know most of my cardigans flanagans or flanagans flannels and like sweaters are women. Um, this is a women's piece yeah, no, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> <sure> with me. <laughs> well, thanks, man. Yeah, enjoy. No worries.